Where do I go? Hit the B button. Checked underfoot. But nothing was found. That's a worthless button. What the fuck? Ugh. Stupid. I hate this open world RPG shit. They never tell you where to go. God, Dragon Warrior? I'm like, Dragon shit. Oh. Hey, guys. Playing a little bit of games. Um, you know what I was thinking about doing? Did anybody ever play Adventures of Lolo? Yeah, me either. Apparently it was a great game. It came out in 1989 by the same people who did uh, Kirby and uh, Smash Brothers and those things. 1989. I was probably like six at the time. Never really played it. I played all the Mario games and all the, all the really good games. But never played any of the... Any of the oh. Some people say this is a good game, but I never really played anything other than the Mario stuff or the really st good stuff like Contra and stuff like that. So I figured I'd play a little bit of Adventures of Lolo, see what it's all about. So it's like the little little like water guy, and he and he's he's trying to save trying to save Princess L uh, Lala in some castle. So you have to collect all the hard pieces in each each board, and then you move on to the next one. And then you go up. You have four boards. You go up to the next level until you finally get to the end. So, how about we take a trip down uh, Retro Lane and see what uh, what Lolo is doing? Adventures of Lolo, made by Hal, like I said previously. No, don't leave, please. Lala, don't go. I don't know what that is. Maybe it's his father or something like that. Whatever. Do do do. Ever skip it? Hal Laboratory, 1988, 1989, licensed by Nintendo of America. As he slowly walks to the castle, but 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 save the captured princess Lala from the great devil's empire. Evil empire. Excuse me, I can't talk English. So here I am. Alright, so I got the caterpillar guy. He's being a real prick. He's not gonna get out of the way. And you, Lolo, the little water tadpole guy. Have to uh, get past him. So you in a board, you gotta collect all the red hearts. And a lot of times with the red heart, you can shoot things. Like, I can shoot this douche back here. Get out of here, you! And you can roll him somewhere. Ta-da, done. So then you could just then you hit that, enemies are gone. On to the next board. Same thing. Second verse, same as the first. Grab the hearts. Ignore these guys because they're not gonna hurt you because they're standing still. Whatever, horn toad. Grab the other heart. Grab the other heart. And you can only ever have two. You only ever have two of the uh, heart things. As you see on the on the top right here, you see how many lives Lolo has, and on the bottom, it's on the, uh, below that is the amount of uh, shots you have. So watch out for these guys. are gonna shoot fire hose. Oh, Get the thing. On to the next level. This is this is great. This is like the best game ever I've ever played. Some people say it's a classic. I'd say it's a classic. I don't know what it is. It's kind of boring. Now what you can do here is actually I didn't know this originally. Double tap. Bop, bam, and he's gone. Get the horn. Another heart. Um, and then the guy falls asleep. I don't understand it at all, but he must have some kind of like issue or something, so. Whatever. I'm gonna grab the rest of the hearts and be done with it. So, I mean, pretty much the game's self explanatory, and really. Um, there's no real special controls, I guess you could say. Ta-da, they're gone. Go to the next thing. 
Yay. So there's like heart things here. I mean skulls. I don't know what they do, but you can move these blocks if you want. I don't know what it's for. Maybe I, what I could do here is block this guy in. The only thing I could figure, maybe they, when I get all the hearts, they kind of come alive. So I'll block him in. Same with this dude, I guess. Just in case this is not, like, fun for me, I'll block him in. Maybe that's a good thing to do. I don't know. Alright, so now... What to do here, really? There you go. Aha! See? I'm like a genius. Look at this. I blocked them in. They can't hurt me. Take that, skulls. Take that, evil. Uh oh. Hey! Woo! Next level! Um. Okay. These. Uh, these guys are fast. What? Come on! What? Ridiculous! What the? What the? What the hell, dude? Look, you can't even move. You can't even move. Let me out, you prick! Let me out. See, this is the problem with <laughs> with caves. They have me stuck. I can't do anything. What can I do? I can reset the game. What's the point of Lolo having five lives if you can't? If you can't die, I cannot die. These guys will not kill me. I can sit here for hours. I cannot die. Oh my god. What a stupid piece of shit this is. Hello? Classic, classic my ass. Yeah, it's, it's so classic that everyone remembers it. That everybody remembers it because they can't goddamn die. You have to hit reset and start all over. Because you cannot die and start at the beginning. Ugh, oh, god. <sighs> Come on. What else can you do? Hit reset and play it over again. Or play something else. Whatever. It doesn't matter. <sighs> Adventures of Lolo. Adventures of me being bored off my ass. Essentially, pretty, you know, pretty simple concept. Not really anything crazy. I mean, it's pretty easy, but... The game itself, or the programmers, made it hard. Hard because it's stupid. Are you serious? I got stuck. They wouldn't let me out. The whatever ghost thing wouldn't let me out. So I just sit there. I could sit there all day and not and not be able to move out of that place. I'd have to hit the reset button. Reset button for what? They put me in a corner that I couldn't get out of. That's lame. You should have just died. And then I'd at least start over. Essentially the same thing as resetting, but still. At least it's part of the game. Resetting is not part of the game. Or it shouldn't be. Ugh, my god. Adventures of me being bored. Jesus Christ. It got good reception, too, when it came out in 1989. Now, granted, I know it's 2012, and we've been playing Call of Duty and, like, Uncharted and stuff like that, which are great games. Keeping a, mi a mindset that this is a historical game, a game from the past... It does not hold up. Games hold up. I can still play games. I can still play Mario games. I can still play Contra. This game you still can't play. Oh, that was... That, oh, God! That's... Ugh, what a pile of dog shit. I've taken dumps more entertaining than this game. Oh, if Adventures of Lolo is in your, in your cabinet, pick something else. I gotta get something to wipe, the, wipe this bad taste out of my mouth. This is stuff that's gonna wipe the taste out of my mouth. <laughs> Later.